everyone. I appreciate you being here today. I appreciate your questions. Let's see what you've asked this time. What book would you recommend everyone read? Ooh, <laughs> one book that everyone should read. Is there such a book? I don't know. I think that we're all at such different places uh, in our journeys and in, in our lives. And oftentimes the, the right book seems to come to you at the right time. And, and then it has that impact. And uh, we all interpret, right? We all interpret the meaning of, of something as, as we read it. So the same book won't speak to the same two people in the same way. And remember that you're not the same person from moment to moment. So if you read a book five years ago, that doesn't mean maybe you shouldn't read it again because now you as a new human will see it in a new light and it'll potentially change you that way. So. I'm not really a fan of, oh, there's, there's this one book and if you read it, it will change you because I, I don't know what you need to hear right now, but I'm sure that you will hear it uh, somewhere, uh, anywhere. Your, your brain's looking for it. Your brain's open for it. It may be in a song. It may be in a poem. It may be in nature. It may be in a moment of stillness. It may be, you know, come from so many places. So I'm very hesitant to say it has to be a book or it has to be a particular book. So when in doubt, see what you're drawn to and, and go there and you'll find truth and wisdom in it. Cause oftentimes this journey is, is so much more subjective than we think. So trust your brain to find the words that it needs to hear. And you're going to do just fine. Uh, oftentimes, regardless of what particular book you're reading. So thank you for asking that question. I apologize for dodging it, but I just really don't feel like I can give a universal answer on that one, but I appreciate you. I appreciate everybody tuning in and I will of course look forward to seeing you back here next time.